Hi, I'm Patrick Starr from the Weekly Tech Channel, and today I'm going to tell you how to run uh, DOS games on your iPad. Now, this will require a couple different things, and your iPad does not have to be jailbroken. First, you're going to go um, to the App Store, and you're going to get a program by Fast Intelligence called iDOS. Uh, you may have heard of this program before, uh, but it was pulled from the App Store due to how easy it was to load up DOS games onto your iPad. Um, this is a universal app application, so it'll work bo both on iPad and iPhone, but it is currently free from the market. So that is the first thing you're going to get. And then when you go load up the app here, iDOS. <clears throat> Um, it's got uh, uh, pre-built games into the into the store, so you can go visit the iDOS store, and these are the games that you can just instantly download for free and launch them. When you launch them, so you want to launch Duke Nukem, it'll launch, and then there you go, you got Duke Nukem. So the second thing you're going to need is uh, iPhone Explorer, um, so you can browse your file system of your device. Uh, they have downloads for both Mac and PC. Um, I have already downloaded the Mac version. When you get into your iPhone Explorer, you're going to go find the iDOS folder and then go to the Documents folder and just start adding things that you want into your iDOS folder. Uh, like I added um, Doom, ZSNES. ZSNES, um, it does not really work. It's really slow. So you'll have a lot of trouble playing Super Nintendo games on it, but um, I did try it. Uh, cool Spot, Capture the Flag, and Scorched Earth. So after you drag and drop all these, and you can drag and drop pretty much anything into here. Um, after you drag and drop them, go back to the iPad, click on the C Drive button. You'll have your C, which is your, uh, your documents folder. So I'm going to play Scorched Earth. So I'm going to type in regular C commands and I've got a, a keyboard here. This program also has a built-in keyboard you can bring up right there. But we're not going to use that for now because I've got one keyboard here. But You'll do CD for change directory and then S-C-O-R-C-H for Scorched Earth. And then the name of the file to start it is scorch.exe. And then it'll load up Scorched Earth. And then you're playing playing DOS games on your iPad. And it works totally great. And it's fantastic. And any DOS game should work for you in here.